So what we're looking at in a nutshell is that we're going to have two days in August, in the middle of August, and hopefully in a theater, a proper response by the theater that's going to be people. And we're going to promote it, of course, in our alliance with the convention on the GI. And hopefully we'll get some people from the international pictures come here. Right. And this is Vancouver, and, uh, you know, we still don't like have a space to do. And I think the funds that we are going to have to speak to, so every Sunday, we're going to give it to charity. Now, what we as Lions Club, we have a woman. But of course, we'd like to collaborate with the city to make it go happier for the women. And uh, so, uh, so basically, what we're looking at right now is that to energize the city, put it on the map worldwide because of, because of the Lions Club's huge dimension, which is moving up, and get them to come here, maybe put some stuff going on for the entire week. But we only have two days. So what we're looking at is maybe the um, any kind of theater that can seat maybe 800 people or more. And um, and I'm putting together right now a team of people that are like-minded, smart, energetic, and can think on their feet, and they can move fast. And now, if we do well, it can become full-time because you're a production company. But right now, what we're trying to do is get the thing off the ground and get people energized, get people to come here to the United City, show them first class entertainment, show them that uh, we care about other people and other people. We every cent, and I'm talking about the first class, of the ticket sales or go to charity. No admin. All volunteers. <laughs> And Deb, you're talking about the fact that you're hoping to bring potentially cultural tourists to Vancouver as part of the celebration. It makes the trigger me to say that also another website for folks to check out is one that we just did launch. I think that there's been a slide of it here, but it's called Celebrate Vancouver 125.ca. This is the public site that we will have that four organizations um, that have been funded. Um, or really, once we get into kind of stage two of the rollout of this website, um, there'll be opportunities for you to post information about your events, funded or no, if they're taking place uh, in the city of 126. The track kind of lots of social media components, there's blogs and Twitter feeds and uh, videos, and, and it's meant to be really interactive. So again, if there's means that we can, as a community, come forward to say, what if we got this happening between January and December 2011? We're really wanting this to be uh, a very active site that's able to help promote all of the 